Hey, welcome to Growing Devotions for Your Daily Life. Can you hear me? I'm wearing this so you don't get my germs. No, I'm wearing this because as I thought about this protection over your mouth, how many times have you wished that you said something and you wish you'd never said it and you wish you had something to shut your mouth? You know, there's a joke when you're joking around with people, sometimes they say, shut your mouth. But actually, Proverbs 13, 3 says, shut your mouth. It says, he who guards his mouth preserves his life, but he who opens his lips wide will have destruction. He who guards his mouth. Think about it. God gave us teeth. He gave us lips. He gave, it, he gave us a double locking mechanism. So there's times where we would shut our mouth and quit talking. So we wouldn't say the wrong thing. You know, the problem is, the Bible says in James, that if you've learned to control your tongue, then you can control the rest of your body. The sad truth is, sometimes your tongue can cut your own throat. He says, if you open up your mouth wide, it can lead to destruction. This can be long-term destruction, or it can be a short-term destruction. It can be in the time of uh, adversity or a trial, or it can be a time of peace. There's been a lot of people that's been in peace and they said something in their marriage, relationships with their children, in leading a country, and they've started a war because of the tongue. You know, the Bible's been saying it for years. Shut your mouth sometimes and just quit talking because we find ourselves, we're not always in the Spirit, we're not always walking in the Spirit, and there's times where we hurt people, we say we slander people, and we say things that honestly, we just don't mean at that time. Maybe we say it out of hurt, maybe we say it out of anger, or we say it out of jealousy. But we need to learn to put the cover over our mouth and just shut our mouth sometimes. Have a good day.